Today through this video we are going to learn that how we will do connection of a contactor with a timer so that contactor will turn off automatically after some time. After how much time it will turn off depends on how much time we set in this timer. Now to make this starter I will explain you everything through circuit diagram. Along with this I will explain you everything practically also. Ok then let's start the video. Friends suppose you have a motor to turn on and off that motor you are using this contactor. With power terminals of contactor you connected the motors. Now after turning on this contactor you want this contactor to be turned off automatically after some time. Suppose your contactor turned on. Now after half an hour you want to turn off this contactor. To turn off your motor automatically you need to use on delay timer. Now these two device here how to do connection of these let's understand. So in the circuit diagram here whole connection is explained. In this connection you can see we have to connect phase supply with a push button. This push button will be our start push button. On pressing this button our motor will turn on and to turn off motor in this circuit I will not use any stop push button. To turn off motor automatically only timer will be used. So with this start push button we have to connect two wires. One wire will be of phase supply and second wire with A1 terminal of this contactor we have to connect this wire. So let us do this much connection first. For now I have a push button here. I connected two wires with the terminal of this push button. Now take one wire of this start push button and in this MCB with phase terminal of MCB connect this wire. Now take second wire of this push button and in this contactor with A1 terminal of this contactor as you can see here A1 is written. So with this terminal connect second wire of this push button. Now according to the circuit diagram from the phase supply take one wire and NC contact of this timer here provide incoming power supply to this contact. For this I am taking a wire and in this MCB with phase supply I am connecting this wire. Now take other end of this wire and with NC contact of timer. As you can see in this timer here in this circuit diagram it is told that 5 number and 8 number terminal is NC contact. So we have to use NC contact. I am taking this wire and with 5 number terminal here I am connecting this wire. Now this base of timer here at output of this base where we will get power supply of NC contact connect one wire with this contact. So I am connecting this wire. Now take other end of this wire and with NO contact connect this wire. Now in this circuit diagram you can see from this timer power supply is going to NO terminal of contactor and from here to A1 terminal of contactor one wire is looped. We have to loop a wire here because if we press start push button then power supply flows from here and it turn on the contactor. And when contactor gets on NO contact of this is converted into NC contact and power supply flows from here to hold the contactor. It means right now we are making holding circuit. So to make holding circuit what we will do in this contactor with NO contact connect one wire in this way. Now take other end of this wire and with coil terminal of contactor here with this terminal connect this wire. So we made the holding circuit. Now after this what we have to do this timer here to this timer we have to provide power supply from NO contact of this contactor and we will provide neutral power supply directly. So I am connecting these two wires. After that I will explain you working. So take one wire and with NO contact of contactor connect this wire. Take other end of this wire and in this timer to turn on timer provide phase supply. To provide phase supply I am using two number terminal of this base. Now to operate this contactor and timer I need to provide neutral power supply also. For neutral power supply I am using two black wire. Take these two wires and with this MCB connect these wires. Now take one end of one wire and with A2 terminal of contactor like here is A2 terminal. So with this terminal I am connecting this wire. After this take second wire and neutral terminal which is there to operate timer. I am connecting this wire with this terminal. In this base to which terminal which wire you have to connect if you want to find out. Then for this simply look at the circuit diagram on timer. In this circuit diagram it is told at 2 number and 7 number terminal you have to provide input power supply. And symbol of NONC contact is made here. So whenever you go for connection then first of all go through the circuit diagram. According to that do the whole connection. So according to this circuit diagram I did the whole connection. Now this timer I have I am connecting this timer with the base in this way. After connecting this in this timer we have to set time. For now I am setting 7 seconds time in this timer. Now with this contactor I am connecting this lamp so that you will be able to know whether contactor is in on condition or not. 
so finally our starter is ready now now i am turning on the mcb after turning on the mcb if i press start push button then you can see my contactor is turned on this contactor will remain on for 7 seconds after this it will turn off automatically for now just to explain you i set 7 seconds time in this timer if you want 30 minutes or 1 hour as per your requirement you can set the time when this contactor is turning off this timer is also getting reset this is why when i press this again it will turn on again if you provide connection of timer directly then in this condition if your contactor goes off once then you cannot turn on this again but right now in this circuit you can turn on this contactor again friends i made a video in which i told with the timer how we can connect sensor so that through sensor we can operate timer and through the timer we can turn off our load if you want to watch this video then click on the right hand side video you will get a lot to learn something new through this video thanks for watching this video